people I need. Now, I know y'all know teenagers, but y'all got teenagers around right the house, right? You see, if it wasn't for Barbara Rice, it wouldn't be no 50 cent be a dime or something like that. Be rapping and seeing my Mike Y'all know that. I started up. Well, thanks to the picture, I'm gonna hit to the hot girl, don't my go.
up the blues. Tonight we are moving you from legendary to icon officially. You can remove, remove the words legendary from your itinerary. Uh, who was born Emmett Ellis Jr. in Homer, Mississippi. I'm sorry, Homer, Louisiana. And he later moved to Jackson, Mississippi to find his roots for his enslaved ancestors. In the 70s, he wrote songs called Chicken Head. It was released on Galaxy and became his breakout record. In 2007, he became the first blues artist to perform in China. Good luck now. Earning him the title International Dean of the Blues. And he was later named Friendship Ambassador to the Great Wall of China. Can we give it up for that part? After performing the largest concert ever held in that site. And whereas he has toured the entire marketplace from from Asia to Mississippi. That's right. And check this out. Whereas, as of the age of 83, he won his very first Grammy for the album Porcupine. And then two years later, he went back and won his second Grammy Award for Raw and Raw in the category of Best Blues album. So it's no wonder that he's still standing here at 92, kicking his legs up above his head. <laughs> Whereas it is abundantly fitting and proper on this second annual Juneteenth National Independence Day in the great state of Georgia, commemorating the emancipation of enslaved African Americans to recognize you, salute you, and honor you, and name you I come. Now, therefore, be it resolved that Bobby Rush, the king of the Chitlin Circuit, international dean of the blues, friendship ambassador, is recognized for his continuous contributions to American music, its history, and as an international bridge builder to the world. It is my greatest honor to be able to present this to you today, Mr. Bobby Rush. Once again, put your hands together for Mr. Bobby Rush. He's at an age we ain't finna rush him doing nothing. Kill that. Give it up one more time for his band, too. They should know every note they've been playing for 43 years ago. That's all right. Lord, please give me that kind of energy at, at 89 years old. That's all right right there. Woo. And give it up for the two young ladies that were accompanying him. Won't he do it? <laughs> 